All right, so once again, we're going to do a little bit of crafting. Um, this is again on my main account. I'm going to equip my steel efficiency gear, which again is my went, as you can see. Um, just to show you a couple pieces on the went. Uh, this is healing and training. Seal efficiency. So just so you get a little bit of an idea. Um, okay, so we're going to go into recipes real quick. And close that out. We're going to go down to the wooden bucket. We're going to forge wooden buckets. Then we're going to upgrade materials to yellow. Now this is kind of a cheaper way to do armory. Um, you know, because if you're free to play, you don't really have the ability to get these materials to do this. I'm going to gamble on this one. It came out legendary, which is a good thing. <laughs> um, but yeah, when you're doing a free to play, um, you can't really do a stacked armory the way you normally would. Now this is going to be an orange. Um, so you kind of have to deal with what you've got. Um, and this is kind of a cheaper way to get the armory stats without having to break your bank. As you can see I'm doing a couple of orange ones. I might have some already crafted. We're going to do a purple here just so that I can try to save on some materials. The game catch up a little bit. Okay, so we did a purple bucket. So now I'm going to back out of this, go into event gear, go to Kingswood, or Kingsguard, sorry. We're going to go to Kingsguard. Now when you're crafting event gear, it starts at a level 5. You can't do a level 1. So you do basic mats for sacrifice for the level 5. Um, that's why I did the wooden buckets. So I'm going to do the um, go through and I'm going to start with the sword. Now this little helmet and sword thing up at the top corner is the collection points for that piece. <coughs> now I showed you yesterday in the trinket crafting that you can select uh, what you're going after as far as qualities. And as you can see with the fine, the collection points changed to 20. And again, I have green beakers to show that I have the materials to make sure that it will be at least a minimum of blue. I can upgrade materials to blue because of that green beaker. Um, purple. Same thing, I have the materials to ensure it's a purple. I have materials to upgrade to the orange. And the collection points went up to 40. And legendary, I can make a legendary and collection points went up to 140. So that kind of gives you an idea of what you're dealing with. Um, and I'll leave it at that for right now because we're going to aim for that. Now, here you can see how much materials I have. I'm going to upgrade it to the yellow, which is the legendary. Uh, my silk is kind of on the down. <laughs> Didn't realize how much silk I had. Okay, now here, um, because of how much of the Kingswood Oak it takes, I'm not going to upgrade all of that. I'm going to go for the orange here. Now, I have plenty of wooden buckets. I have um, colors, and it looks like I have a falcon helmet too. So we're going to do the yellow. It's a higher percentage. It's about 76%. We're going to take this as a gamble. 
and hope that it comes out the yellow that I'm looking for. And it did. <coughs> Next we're going to do the ring. And again, I have enough of the advanced mats to upgrade to that. Here I have enough poppy to upgrade to the yellow. Uh, I have enough of the copper bar for it. And I have another yellow helmet. This is 100% yellow, so it will be a yellow. And I go a little bit faster than the game can keep up with. Uh, so we're going to collect that. Um, and then we're going to do the plated fold. Uh, here again, upgrade to the yellow. Um, here I can upgrade from the blue to the yellow. So I don't have to use any of the gray basic. Same thing here. Um, and here we're going to use an orange bucket. It's a little bit of a gamble. It's 46% yellow, 53% orange. And let's see if I can't do that uh, gold gamble here that I was talking about in the trinket video. And it worked. Now again, that gold trick doesn't always work. Um, some people swear by it, as I pointed out in the crafting video I did yesterday with the trinkets. It doesn't always work. But sometimes you get lucky. I'm not going to do the gold in the weirwood. Let's do an orange in the weirwood. And we'll do an orange bucket. So now we've got 69% in the yellow, or in the orange, and 30% in the yellow. And epic. Which is fine, because we only need... I'll show you what I mean. Um, we don't need all of the pieces yellow. It helps, but it's not 100% necessary. Okay, so we're going to leave the boots out for right now. We're going to go into the armory. Now this account, the armory is pretty full. Um, it's not the highest power because I have done it this way. Um, as you can see, most of it is level 5s uh, with one piece at a higher level. Um, but we're going to go into the King's Guard. And we're going to just equip each piece here. And as I equip pieces, you'll see the stats start coming up. Okay. So, so far, uh, without, a, without the boots... These are the stats that it has, and the collection points are 600, so the level is 25. <coughs> We're going to go back in to the crafting. Now you can do it this way with the recipes. You can select the boots. For some reason, my game is glitching and it's showing that. But anyways, let's see what I can do here. This is going to be a huge, massive gamble. Um, I don't really have any sacrifice pieces in the level 30 that I can do. So we're going to use a template. Now the templates get pretty darn pricey in this range. Huge jump. And another big jump. But we're going to stick with the common 
I have a little bit of gold on this account. We're going to stick with the common. Now, this is a massive gamble. Okay. So, could go my way or not. And it didn't. It went poor. Womp womp. Okay. So, let's try to see if I can get a better quality in the 30. Showing here that I can upgrade to the purple, which will increase my odds a bit. We'll upgrade that. Um, here I don't have the materials to upgrade. Here I do. And again, we'll go with the template. We'll do a common template. And again, this is a huge gamble. And I am well aware of the gamble. Try the gold trick. And it came up poor again. <coughs> so, like I said, I know that those were gambles. Um, but it's okay. We'll equip the 35. And I'll show you other pieces in my armory here in a second. But as you can see, it unlocked all of the stats by having um, the level 35 in there. It did bring the collection up to 83. I'll show you some other pieces I have here um, so that you can see kind of what my armory in this account looks like. Now, one of the best ways to do the armory if you're a free to play is to definitely try to do all level 5 golds. Like I have the Dornish set here. If you can, you want to be able to do at least one piece in the highest level, highest quality you are capable of. Which is why I put the 35 pour in there. Um, the Bravosi, as you can see, level 25 green. Bolton has the 35 and the 30. Blackfire has a 30, Mormont has a 30, Wildling has a 35 gray, uh, Faith Militant has 15s, so that one's pretty high. Uh, my Reaver, I have the two um, legendaries in there to help with that. Corsair is pretty high. Corthine is the highest with the two orange 30s in there. Dothraki. My Lannister is probably one of my highest collections. However, because I don't have the two legendaries in there, it's actually showing less stats because I don't have the two legendaries. And then my Stark. Um, again, like I said with the Lannister though, it has to have the legendaries. Anyways, that's a kind of a quick crash course on the armory. Um, to do it cheaply, you can do all level 5 golds. You can do level 5 golds and then the highest level and the highest quality you can. Um, like I have the Mormont and like I have the Wildling. Uh, the Blackfire, same thing. It doesn't get you the highest stats, but it does fill the stats. So that helps... Um, and then you can go back as you get materials and upgrade those pieces. So anyways, that's a quick review of the armory. And this, as you can see, my power did go up a little bit. But my armory power is now 754. So that does help a little bit. Hopefully this helps.